Hello, it's that college football guy with another video. This is the one I was talking about. Well, University of Tulsa, after having a rather disappointing season in the American, decided to fire their head football coach, Philip Montgomery, who's been there for eight seasons. Uh, formerly on the, I believe he was formerly on the Art Briles Baylor staff. He uh, has had an actually pretty good coaching record there at Tulsa. Um, was it as good as they were hoping it could be? Obviously not. But they wanted to go in a different direction. Um, I've seen a little bit of interviews with Phil Montgomery in the, in, in the past here and there. He seemed like a great guy. He seemed like someone who was really had their grasp fully on what they needed to do there and seemed committed to do it. But for some reason, sometimes it just doesn't work out. Um I wish him nothing but the best in finding a new job. I think he'll probably find a job being a coordinator again uh, at the group of five level. Possibly he may be an analyst at a larger program. Could he possibly come back uh, to one of his former jobs? I don't think Baylor would bring him back because of the Baylor situation. Maybe as an analyst, I doubt Baylor would do that. Um, is he a big enough name to possibly go into the Nick Saban of uh, Repair job, uh, rehabilitation clinic that's for his coaches? I don't think so. I don't think he's big for that one, but I think he could be a coordinator at the group of five level or a position coach at the power five level. Um, as for potential candidates, I have no idea. I'm figuring some hot group of five offensive coordinators would probably fit the bill uh, or a hot position coach from the power five school would probably be the candidates. We'll find more about that in the future. Um but, uh, wow, it's, he had eight years and had a great run there, but uh, unfortunately it's time for a change in direction. So Philip Montgomery now out as the head football coach at the University of Tulsa. Uh, so let me know what y'all think about in the comments down below. I mean, it's I talk about primarily the Power Five, but I do mention the group of five schools, and I'm not ignoring things. So let me know what you think down in the comments about this. Was this a surprise to you? I mean, it's somewhat of a – he had been on a bad run, so I get that, but he really wasn't that bad off. I mean, I – I don't know if they decided not to give me any more time. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this, okay? So thanks, everybody, for watching this video. Hit the thumbs up. Helps the analytics. Helps the algorithm. Helps the video get seen by more people. Comment on the video. want to hear from you. I want to interact with you, so let me know what's going on. Subscribe to the channel, all right? Cell signal up here where I'm at is bad. I'm going to see how well these load up. And I have to upload the video for the recap for last week for week 13 of the college football season. That's going to be up along with the review of the games I didn't get to. So we'll see how long this late gets. I may have to, if it's going bad enough, it may not get getting uploaded until Monday. If it's bad enough on the recording, I mean, it may not even try to unload it until Monday morning. So we'll see what happens. But thanks somebody for watching the video. I hope you hit the thumbs up on the video. Thanks somebody for watching. Be safe out there and please be good to each other.